My name is Brian Skeety and I'm a clinical teaching physician associate. So on a day-to-day -day basis, my job varies quite a bit. So my time is split between clinical time and um, teaching time. So on my teaching time days, if I have anything scheduled in or to involve me teaching some medical students or some physician associate students. So it involve either a lecture-based teaching or it'd be bedside teaching. So I'd be taking the students to see patients with actual signs and um, getting them to review them, maybe take a history as well. Then on my clinical days, it involved me being on the ward. So it involved me having a ward round um, with the consultants, um, seeing all the patients and then getting a list of jobs, then carrying the jobs out throughout the day. And um, sometimes later on, it might involve maybe going into like clinics or going into theatres as well to help out in surgery. So um, for to be a clinical teaching physician associate, um, you need to be a physician associate. So to become a physician associate, you need to have a postgraduate degree in physician associate studies. So uh, you need to have an undergraduate degree in a science-based or a healthcare-based. And then it's a two-year master's um, studying to be a physician associate, including with placements. And then after you've done that, um, to be able to be a clinical teaching physician associate, you need to have at least one year's experience working clinically and have some sort of teaching experience as well. So the main skills and characteristics that I require to be able to do the role, I'd say, would be being resilient, um, being enthusiastic, um, hardworking, um, understanding, um, having good communication skills as well. So with this job role, I think the career development is quite big. So. With the teaching side of things, you can get a teaching degree to kind of expand your knowledge as well. Um, so maybe getting to go teach um, at conferences or other university students. Um, clinically, um, with a job role, with being a physician associate and being kind of like general um, medically trained, you can work in different specialities. So it's quite easy to change specialities if you need to. Um, you can get trained to do extra skills as well, depending on what um, department you're working in. So if you're in surgery, you might be doing um, surgical skills, so such as abscess draining or being able to assist in theatres. In different departments for respiratory, you might be able to work um, doing chest drains, um, doing pleural taps as well. And if you're working in gastroenterology, you can do aesthetic drains as well. So the possibilities are really horrendous. So you're able to kind of gain different skills, um, work in different departments. I'd probably say the best part of my job would be getting to meet different people every day, um, whether it be students or patients. It's quite good to kind of um, be able to kind of communicate and understand where people come from, um, what their lives have been like, especially with everything that's been going on with COVID and lockdown. I think being at work is probably one of the best things to still get to meet new people and help them in different ways. Um, if I describe my job in one word, I would say that it is enjoyable. Mm -hmm.